Hello everybody and welcome to my new channel. You might recognize this. Now before we get into the video, I just want to make a disclaimer. Um, you might recognize me as Dirty Dennis from ages ago, but that shit's changed. I don't do that kind of content anymore. Um, the thing is, back then I was kind of dumb. I was pretty dumb. And the thing is, I really realized that, uh, I want to change my content up because most people along with their stuff, they change their content. So what I want to do is I've gotten buff. What was what? Buff. Pretty buff. <laughs> nice flexing. But yeah, um, for what I want to do. But what I want to do is that, sorry for the flexing by the way, it's just I like flexing myself off and I, pre I look pretty hot when I flex myself off. What I want to do is that I want to start a new YouTube channel. And the thing is, I've realized that, you know, when I explain things, when I explain things about when I ended things with all my hookups, um, and when I ended things with my ex group, I acted like pyrocynical a lot and I was like, well, what kind of content can I make out of this? Commentary and vlogging because my personality is better now. I'm not gonna do retarded shit and I want to vlog and keep you guys entertained. You guys are my fans. I love you. Please like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications so you don't miss one of my banger videos. With that being said, on to the video. Oh, uh, hey, hello, boys. It is me, your very favorite Eskimo Paradise. Oh my fucking god, these these things are itchy as fuck. You might be wondering, this is the last thing you want to see, this area, a fucking 20 year old man who just graduated high school, dressed up as a fucking retard. I got this thing at my friend's birthday party last year, I remember winning Costume King and I was just like, yay, but in reality I'm just like, I might be verified up here but i'm not verified in here fucking deep bro these things are itchy as fuck but i have to keep these on for the duration of the video so oh my god now recently your boy jake paul has gotten into some drama yeah that's all i'm gonna say now i know i'm a bit late on this topic um keep in mind oh these things are itchy as fuck you know, the best way to fix itchy glasses, put them on the other way. Yeah, I think this is, this actually look like a fucking retard, but that actually works by the way. So anyways, your boy Jake Paul recently got into some massive, massive drama. And by drama, I don't just mean it's his normal um, suicide forest, that stuff, even though I was Logan Paul. <laughs> I did say I was going to be funny, like Pyrocynical, but I'm not going to copy Pyrocynical because I have too much respect for that lad. I'm also not going to say the N-word. Jesus fucking Christ. I got to take a massive dump, but I'm trying to hold it in. Oh my God. He's itchy again. Okay. Now, now back on topic, Jake Paul um, was recently swatted. His two house, he was swatted along with... Um, Aman Izadi, who I think is his manager, um, they were swatted a couple, a month ago, I think, or two months ago, I have no idea. Haven't really given me keeping track, I've been too busy doing my own stuff, but they've been swatted a long time ago, and they're swatted. And the truth is, this this is, people think this, oh, it's a prank, because remember, 2017, Jake Paul released, uh, bruh, I gotta, I gotta shit, but I wanna make this video so badly. As you remember, in 2017, Jake Paul made a video about... What, what's this? It's fucking semen on my goddamn hand. Oh. Anyways, as you remember, in 2017, Jake Paul made a video about um, being arrested. And turns out it was fake. The cops were from Cop Shop LA where you can hire a fake police officer for, you know, filming, stunts, videos, all that kind of stuff. Personally, I don't live in LA. I live in 
I live in India, so it doesn't... I, I don't want to fucking live in India. Um, either way, it's... Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll be right back. I, I really got to fucking defecate. You may have noticed why I changed rooms. That's because... Well, fuck my holy this thing for it. As this is a this is my first Pokemon Sword and Shield starter. I'm Team Sobble now. Get that shit out of here. Anyways, it's because I just felt this room's better, better air conditioning, better atmosphere. You can you can smell the shit. Anyways, so recently your boy Jake Paul got into some drama. Now, basically, this drama would really involve stuff like, oh, yeah, um, uh, like, it could be fake. But the thing is, from checking, from, the thing is, from checking, um, recent, uh, posts, recent accusations of Armani Zadi, turns out Armani Zadi has been accused of all sorts of really fucked up shit. Prostitution, um, pimping, um, drug usage, abuse. Um, there have been women coming out, people claiming that, oh yeah, um, Armani Zadis, um, people have come out about him saying that he's a pimp, he's a rapist, he kills people. And there was even one interview where he literally said, oh yeah, um, something like along the lines of admitting to being a pimp. Now, obviously, this has caused a lot because, along with Team Ten's mansion, the Ar Armani Zadis graffiti house was also raided. Yeah, it was raided at the same time as the Team Ten mansion. So, according to analysis, why well, my computer checking right now? Yeah, I know this is an old fucking computer. Someone, well, I can't mention the name of, and he broke my old computer, so we have a new computer. Judging by what I'm checking is that spokesman for the FBI said that an armed SWAT team carried out a raid, which took place in the Paul and not what while Paul was not at home. So pretty much this pretty much emphasized the fact now could this be connected to Jake Paul? Probably because of the recent looting for the Black Lives Matter protest. Considering that Logan Paul was actually being good and um literally donating and spreading awareness for the Black Lives Matter, whereas in Jake Paul was over there looting a bottle of vodka, which was really fucked, and I literally, I was fucking destroyed when I saw that. At first, I would think, you would think out, nothing out of the ordinary, but then you'd think, oh yeah, it's Jake Paul's SWAT looting and stuff. So yeah, in, in terms of that, I really don't think that it's gonna be much of an issue, as if I say so myself, it's not gonna be much of an issue, but, um, yeah, it's not gonna be much of an issue, um, but the thing is, the funny thing about, uh, this whole thing, this whole, uh, whole Jake Paul, Logan Paul, Rice Gum, KSI, please kill me, the funny thing about this is that there's actually been no updates as of now. As a matter of fact, I could search for updates right now and they wouldn't tell me any updates about the swatting. So it's kind of weird and kind of, om um, not ominous, ominous, but just kind of weird in general that the swatting would only have one update then, um, then change to, um, um, wait then literally just change to like nothing. Like we've heard one update so far. I've checked all the drama alert news sources. I've checked every news source scarce, killer, keen star, and Philip the fuck ass, whatever, or filthy Frank, <laughs> Miss Filthy Frank. And there have been no, um, men no more mentions of this whole swatting. I could search for updates considering that I wasn't really caught up on the whole thing. But judging by what I found, I don't think there's really any any updates. As a matter of fact, I think currently, as of now, Jake Paul is still making his own um, videos. Still making videos. We could... Now... We could find more updates of this thing. Um, 
We are going to see uh, Jake. New info. Um, we're going to see this. So, no, there's been no new updates. I think the, pr the recent update was on August 6th. But that was the most recent update because there's been no update so far. I could go on YouTube right now and um, I could go on YouTube and I could literally check. Yeah, this is a tapping computer. A technology has evolved so much. Mm. I'm actually going to switch accounts right now. Um, really bad. Yeah, this is shit. Yeah, I, I know my computer is shit. If you have a better idea of how to make Windows better, Windows is so shit. Oh, and I'm also going to be starting a story fire. Please follow it. Don't follow it. It's shit. I know YouTube is meant to be the dumping ground for all the shit. And the thing is, I'm only starting a YouTube channel. I'm only starting a YouTube channel because I want to idolize Pyrocynical. But story fire. Oh, my God. God, you, you kind of got all these creators posting. Now, I might try Story Fire, see how that goes. Because if you see this video on Story Fire, that means you're all caught up to date. Oh my God. Um, I'm going to switch accounts. I'm going to switch accounts. Switch accounts. Um, add account. Um. Yeah, I know you have to watch me log into my account I'm posting this video on, but trust me, I don't want to make a YouTube account, a YouTube channel on my pri private account because my private account is for me enjoying things only. So we're literally on Jake Paul's video right now. Um, Jake Paul. So yeah. His previous video was, uh, a month ago, yeah? And we're gonna watch one of it, see if, because this one's called Logan and I Address Our Issues. It, it seems pretty good. I mean, it might show that he's honest. So we're gonna go ahead. So, bro. I'm watching this right now, and there's been no address of, there's not been no change. It's about a recent brother, and it's just, there's like no change. So, when was this uploaded? Oh, I accidentally swiped. This was uploaded, um... When the fuck was this uploaded? Oh, August 3rd. So there's been no update since August 6th. So I think I think it's safe to say that Jake Paul, as of now, is in jail. I think as of now, it's safe to say Jake Paul is in jail. And I don't know if he's in jail right now. We could search what happened to Jake Paul, but he hasn't uploaded for a month. Now this could mean that now in normal status, oh yeah, Jake Paul's just taking a break because he's done some pretty fucked up shit. When he cried when Logan lost the match of KSI. Jake Paul's done fucked up shit, so he's probably taking a break. YouTube logic, though. Uh, Jake Paul is in jail. He's in jail. And, and there's nothing you can do about it. Because Jake Paul is in jail. Uh. Oh my fucking god. I, I should stop doing that. People in the comment section are going to point out that I have... I have fucking... Tourette syndrome. Oh, yo, what's up, guys? It's 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 your boy, uh, skinny. Fuck, skinny. He's fuck, 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 fuck. Fucking fuck, fuck. I shouldn't be making fun of that, honestly. Considering that there's actually a guy in my school with Tourette's, and I don't want to be making fun of that. Well, old school. I graduated. <laughs> graduated in two thousand twenty, the year of the coronavirus. I can't believe. What kind of year this is. <laughs> oh, what's that? 2020? I've gotten with two girls. Yeah, 2018, I've gotten with three. F 
Fuck you! That is true, by the way. And by the way, what I'm saying right there, it is actually true. I did hook up with two girls this year. That's not, that's not a video joke. That is actually true. Like, that is literally true. Like, I'm saying that out of honesty. I hooked up with two girls this year and three girls, like, a year ago. Ooh. It's quite a... So, yeah, that's truth. Glad you know something about me. Don't know why I even shared that, though. That was unrelated. So, we could have... We could actually ask the question, what happened to Jake Paul right now? Is he okay? Is he doing mental? Is he is he having a gender change like one of the girls I fucked? Um, let's go ahead and do that. Keep in mind, I fucked a transgender girl. She was good at sex. Low key. I fucking did anal with her. Lasted 10 minutes. I shouldn't be bragging about this. You need to stop with these fucking intros, Eskimanga TV. You have a fucking problem. Mm. What happened to Jake Paul? Okay, um. Wow, uh. Wow, okay, so the real reason why Jake Paul. What happened to Jake Paul? Oh, Jake Paul's quitting. You know what that means? I can't, I can't do the Fortnite dance because I don't want to fucking look retarded on the video and do the fucking Fortnite dance, because I don't even play Fortnite. Bruh. Ah! But yeah, I think that's about all the covers for today. Jake Paul is quitting YouTube. He's done for good. Actually, let's watch that because we can't just assume. So, clever news. What's up, y'all? It's Emil and it's Junior back here in Clever News. Fuck yeah. The sun might be setting on Jake Paul's YouTube career as he claims that the platform is a dead end and he's putting much more focus on his music career. Jake Paul is ready to say goodbye to the platform that put his controversial career on the map as he admitted that he's outworlded the YouTube scene during a night out with Jenna Mojo. On Saturday, caught up with a very This is like actually kind of touching. Considering that Jake Paul's made his landmark on this fucking site. Okay, so it's not confirmed yet that Jake's quitting YouTube, but judging from the not uploading for a month, for a month, he could just be taking hiatus, but I'll just give the benefit of the doubt that Jake Paul has quit YouTube. Well, in celebration of Jake Paul, I'm going to make a montage of all the good shit that Jake Paul has brought upon YouTube. fucking dude with this thing. Uh, we're gonna make a montage about all the shit Jake Paul's on YouTube. Starting from now. Jake Paul, it has been an honor that you serve YouTube. May future YouTube creators God bless you, you fucking scumbag. Other day, yeah. when I was all over the news for being a bad neighbor, and then I'm getting a lawsuit, and then I'm getting evicted. None of these things are true, guys. For the slightest second, you probably believed it, and you probably thought that I was actually a bad neighbor, when in reality, we just do everything inside of our house. Hey. Oh. 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 I wouldn't crawl up there. Why? Okay. I 
I just wouldn't do that. I want to do the interview here. <laughs> It said the neighbor said we made it a living hell. Excuse me, sir. Are you silly? They didn't think I was gonna send it. I mean, imagine what it's like to be in the house. That's oh. horrible. Oh. Oh. This makes us sound like we're the worst kids in the world. Millions of millions of people to inspire and to create a massive army of people who are just have the right mindset. Ah, yeah, there you go. There you go. Oh, 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 this is bad. run, bro. It's out of hand. If anyone asked, it wasn't us. Okay, all right, we should run. Oh, Jake's a bad neighbor. Calm down, son. Calm your face. Nah, bro. We nah, nah. 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 <laughs> They took Erica. Erica! Hey! Erica! No! My wife! Yeah. We're home! Yo, look at how far this thing sticks out past the driveway. <laughs> look, it, we're not causing any harm. They're saying we're blocking the sidewalk. Parking enforcement, giant truck, trampoline, Team 10 house. I better do that. Dang. It was lit! The only thing that made it good was Erica in a bikini, but yeah, that's fine. <laughs> For the slightest second, you probably believed it, and you probably thought that I was actually a bad neighbor. In and I uh, just found out some news from these three and, and Nick. Um, originally, it was just like an offline conversation, like no cameras involved. But when I heard what happened, I was so distraught. I was so in shock. I was so disgusted that I, w I needed to bring this situation to light. Uh, and I'll let Meg tell the story. When I was leaving, he sort of clotheslined me and put their arm out in front of me and tried to like pull me into the place that they were into his table. He like put his arm out and like went like this and I was looking up at him and our faces were really close and he sort of like was I, right I, here. Well, I feel like it was more extreme than yeah. just, I, I mean, I mean, yeah. look at the I mean he and... literally like like dragged you me said, by my neck. Meg said that she, you like lost your breath. Yeah, right? like you he knocked the wind out of me and like he dragged me by my neck and backwards. He, he didn't know you, doesn't know you. Doesn't, I've never met him before. I just know who he is because he's well known in our same community. Yes, yes, yes. Um, and I looked up at him and I realized immediately that it was Banks. And so I got away from him and went back to the people that I was with. Holy shit, I mean. The so I was out with friends last night and we saw someone that we recognized because he is in our same work and I didn't really know whether or not it was him at first because he has a girlfriend and he was making out with this other girl that I knew wasn't his girlfriend so at first I was confused but then I realized it was definitely him. Jake Paul was charged in connection with the protest he attended in Arizona in which a mall was vandalized and looted. Oh my god! 
Oh, oh my God, it's getting crazy. While the YouTube Fashion Square, video of him and his crew inside the mall was posted to Instagram. Police have- I'm just here to document it. I'm not doing okay. nothing. Paul came under criticism for the video, but took to YouTube to defend himself. In hindsight, everything's 2020, and we shouldn't have been anywhere near what was going on, and we should have removed ourselves from the situation. But in the heat of the moment, I wanted to document what was going on and witness it for myself. And that's where I made the poor decision to go inside of the mall. Paul was not arrested, but received a summons to appear in court. I think that's about all it's going to be for today's topic. This is my first video, so don't expect, don't expect to be that good. Though, if the video does come out a bit late, I am sorry. I'm not really good at editing. I'm gonna need. A, I needed a lot of editing for this video because of the scenes, videos, and the fucking eh, just just the stuff really. So yeah, honestly, that's just pretty much about it. But yeah, um, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, please like. Comment, subscribe, share the video, and turn share the video if you like. Share the video and turn on post notifications. With that all being said and done, Eskimanga out. Until next, until next time, fuck off.